everyone, Enrique Zuniga Jr. here. Welcome back, guys, to another movie review. That's right. It's time that I do another movie review because I haven't been doing movie reviews for a long, long time. And it's about time that I do another one. So, yeah. So, in this movie review, I'm going to be reviewing on this movie called The Boss Baby. Yep, this is from DreamWorks and, uh, yeah. So, about The Boss Baby, um... A little more about it. It was released on March 31st of the 2017 in the USA. I mean, the, and, it, and, it, and it got $498.9 million in the box office. Um, and their budget on this film was like $125 million. I don't know why I'm giving you this information, but still just throwing, throwing in some information about this movie and stuff like that. And yeah. So, um, basically, yeah. Anyways, I mean, overall, I mean, this movie was uh, okay, I guess, to watch. I mean, it's about it's about it's about a new baby a new baby's arrival in Pax's family, which is told from the point of view from a delightfully unreliable narrator. And by, and by the fact the narrator was Tobey Maguire, which I didn't even know he was narrating this film, so I didn't know that either. I mean, Tobey Maguire, of course, like the guy who played Spider-Man. In the, in the first three Spider-Man movies, the classic ones, and, um, yeah, so, <laughs> all I know. And, um, a wily, imaginative seven-year-old boy named Tim, uh, the most unusual boss baby, he was boys and boys by Alec Baldwin, arrives at Tim's house in a taxi, wearing a suit and carrying a briefcase, and uh, the instant sibling rivalry must soon be put aside when Tim discovers that boss baby is actually a spy, on a secret mission, and only he can help throw a disasterly plot in the, that involves an epic battle between puppies and babies. I'm like, really? A series of ridiculous, I, I guess a ridiculous epic battle, I guess you say, between puppies and babies. I mean, come on, I love both of them. I love babies and freaking puppies. And puppies are so cute, but but. but, but is it really necessary to be having, to having like an epic battle between these two? I mean, come on. I mean, overall, I mean, the, I mean, I mean, the the animation was was was, was well made. It's just the um, the story. It just it just um it just uh, uh, th threw me off. And it, there were some parts I'm like, oh my god, how long is this? How long do I have to wait? How long do I have to deal with this? I mean, there were some parts of like just. I don't know, a little bit like not interesting in me for some for some reason, but you know, this it's just it's just it was just okay for me to watch. I mean, I didn't I um but that doesn't mean I hate the movie. I mean, I I enjoy it just a little bit, but you know not not throughout the whole film. I mean, there were some parts that are like oh okay, I'm like what's going on or like oh come on you know stuff like that. I mean. Because to be honest, I mean, uh, the Rotten Tomatoes gave it a 52%. I mean, uh, I IMDb gets 6.4 out of 10, and just yeah. I mean, it's. Oh, I mean, overall, it was. I mean, there were there were some parts that that didn't make me chuckle a lot, but it. it but the, the, there were the, there were parts that didn't make me laugh a lot. I mean, because it wasn't a really funny film. I was. I mean, it was. It was sort of funny, but not not too funny. So yeah. And, um, yeah, I just, it's, 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 it's really something that I have uh, not expected to watch. And, um, yeah. So, uh, in my point of view, I would have give, I, I would give this Boss Baby a rating, a a 5 out of 10. Because it was, I was just, I was just in the middle. I'm like, it was, it was, I was in like... It wasn't really, really enjoyable. It wasn't like the best movie, but you know, it was, it was, it was just okay. I would say. I mean, not the best film, but I, I just, I just enjoy it just a little bit. But overall, it's just, um, just it, overall, I, I still appreciate their hard work on this film and stuff like that. I mean, to be honest, I mean, it was really imaginative. But with, you know, with how the seven-year-old uh, Tim. Like, he always really, with imaginations and stuff like that, he was just, yeah. I mean, there were some parts that were entertaining and stuff like that, and then, yeah. But overall, I, I still enjoyed it a little bit. So, my rating is a 5 out of 10. 
That's the least I can do. So, I mean, that doesn't mean I hate it. I mean, I just, I just wish they could have like, I don't know. I mean, it was, it was better than nothing. I mean, still, oh, it's all right. It's all, it was, it, it was a, it was, a, it was, it was okay movie. But yeah. Well, that's all I had to say about this um, uh, short, short movie review on uh, Boss Baby. I mean. I, I, I guess uh, if, you, if you want to, you, you want to watch it for yourself. I, mean, I, I just watched it because I was bored, because I, because I was, I was, because I was bored and stuff like that. And, and I saw Boss Baby, like you know, why not? I give it a shot of watching it. Blah blah blah. You know. So, yeah. So there's my short review on Boss Baby. So if you guys enjoyed this movie review, don't forget to like this video, share this video with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel for more great videos I'll be doing in the future for you guys. And uh, tell me, tell me, guys, tell, let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of the boss movie. Did, 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 did it suck for you, or uh, like how bad was it for you, or just all these crazy stuff in your opinions? Because to be honest, these are my opinions in my in this movie review. So this is just my opinions, and uh, you don't have to just take it too seriously about my opinions. Because yeah. so thank you all for watching this movie review, guys. I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye!